I get so caught up in the middle thinking of drowning. Good morning everyone. Ayan. So today different naman tayo. Um let's talk about Gymno, which is my new uh uh bagong kinagigiliwan ngayon. <laughs> Uh, although I was able to start collecting gymnos and grafted gymnos uh, last year pa, I kind of lost interest with them. So, medyo nagpahinga sila. Uh, but then again, it started blooming uh, recently this past couple of weeks, a uh, month. So, ito ako, sobrang balik, bali, balik ako sa pagkakahumaling sa kanila. So, this is my other grafted gymno. Malaki na siya. Uh, this one, this one, I uh, pollinated, I tried to pollinate with um, my daydream. Uh, mukha namang kumapit kasi tumataba na siya. Ayan, let's show them there. The other three ones, I don't know kung ano nag-pollinate yung balash sa buhay niya. <clears throat> but this one, ayan, daydream yan. Yung sa daydream naman na pinollinate ko, hindi siya success. So, natuyot lang yung flower, pati yung mismong itong part na to na tumataba. Namayat lang siya and then nag-dry up. So, alam mong hindi successful yung pollination niya. Um, so, now we're gonna try to... Um, I don't know the name of this one, but this one I think is called English Red. Hindi rin ako sure. <laughs> kasi binili ko lang siya. Kasi ang ganda ng kulay niya, tsaka ng pattern niya. But ang cute kasi yellow and pink yung flowers. So, ayan. So, we'll try to show you how to pollinate uh, seeds. I mean, pollen to uh, to each other. And hopefully, we'll be able to successfully uh, pollinate the flowers. So, how we're gonna do it, I'll show you how. First, we'll need the following. Um, a cutter. A box cutter. Para pangputol dun sa may bandang uh, flower. And then, of course, a pointed tweezer so you can pollinate the pistil. Uh, let me just explain a short brief uh, what do you call this uh, elementary identification <laughs> ng mga parts ng ating flower. No? So here, I don't know if I can show it properly. No? Uh, let me see. Ayaw niya mag zoom in. Ayan. So inside the flower, you'll see parang the tiny pollen there tiny pollen located there in the middle and then that is called the stamen yan yung male part nya and then you'll see when you cut naman yan like this one yan this tip here is called the pistil so yan naman yung female part so when we get the pollen later we'll try to put the pollen here in the middle and hopefully i a uh, uh, parang papasok yung pollen all the way down and then this is like parang yung ovary niya kung nandiyan nandiyan yung mga seed magiging seeds niya no so pag na pollinate ng tama yung um yung uh, flower pag na pollinate ng tama tataba siya diyan na yung magi siya na yung magiging seed pod natin i am not an expert i swear so uh i this is me trying out uh for the very second time to pollinate Kasi medyo natuwa ako dahil ang dami kong blooms coming out. So, um, you, ha, you know, it's a must to try. Uh, this one, you, uh, for better, better, pag, so that you don't forget. I mean, since I'm just doing one, so hindi ko na siya nilabel. But, um, suggestion po is that when you're trying to pollinate a lot of blooms, na please put a tag kung sino yung mga parents para alam mo kung sino yung ano yung ano yung magiging resulta ng mga seeds mo so ayan this one um I'll wait for them to bloom and then I'll try to pollinate this with another day daydream so hopefully we'll get a lot of daydreams kasi meron pa akong pollen sir yes. so today ayan let me just show you how I pollinate them so I get a clean cutter ayan there we go um, wipe it with alcohol para at least hindi siya um, contaminated. And then you just try to cut. Oh, let me see. Hold on. Let me move it first. There you go. Yeah. You just have to cut. Ay. There we go. There. there let me adjust that. Okay. 
Okay, so you just have to cut bit right below the the uh, the petals. So what I do is just, I just hold it here, and then I cut around. Mararam, don't cut all the way through, kasi merong kan tatamaan na bakatamaan mo yung pistil. So pag naramdam mo naggive na yung git ng part niya, let go na. I mean, wag mo nang ikat tuloy tuloy. So there. And then here. And then gently, I oh, to ako. Gently remove it. There we go. Can you see? Wala ko. Wala na naman. And there. Hanggang sa ma-expose yung There we go, the center part. Ayan. Ay, medyo mataas. Teka ha. much better so now that you can see this part no this is the pistil we cannot pollinate it with the same flower so what we'll do is that we'll get another one which is the parent flower and so we'll cut also so we will switch ikanga palitan sila ng uh ng pollen There. Some are easier. Uh, this is the second day na nag-bloom siya. This one. Second day na nag-bloom siya. So, hopefully, okay na siya. Pwede na siya. Ayan. Let me open and then show you the male part. Ayan. Ayan yung pollen. So, may mga pahaba-pahaba na yan. There. And then, we will dab it on the, on the other side. So, let's do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, there. There. Can you see? <laughs> it's hard. Hold on. Uh. Ito na muna. I'll show this one first. Okay, so we'll split. What I do is, um, yung iba yung save ko. Para ma pollinate ko sa iba. So, what I'll do is this one. There we go. I'll grab some I'll grab some steam in there. Like that. And then I'll double it here. Um, sabi nila, pwede daw buksan i-pry open ng konti. Para siguradong papasok sa loob. sobrang napaka noob ko sorry I swear I don't know how to do this but I did one successfully so hopefully I was able to do enough ayan so malabo pala yung kanina bayan mo hi 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 you can also use a, a paintbrush, but I don't have currently, so. Nick, tatakpan. Yan, yan, yan. Papasok kaya? <laughs> Sa palast, last, last, last. Since you have so much pollen anyway, so. You can always try to do more. Pry it open a little bit. Mabigat ang kamay ko. My gosh. Okay. Mm. 
<laughs> did it. But I do it right. Oh my goodness, let me let me try to do it one more time. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Last, 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 last na. Last, last, last. Ewan ko na lang kung since it's, you know, it's just fun to try out different things. And especially with gymnos, napaka giving nila. They give a lot of pops. They give a lot of blooms. Napakabait. Napakabait na mga halaman. And, you know, it's color. Sobrang ganda ng color. So, this one, I think, is fine. So, we'll do the other one. There. So, this one naman, I'll use the other, other flower. The pink one. So when you open, it's like this. Okay, wait. Ayan. So when you open, it's like that. Okay, daming pollen. So, siya naman yung ililipat natin. Si Sir Dan, ang ginagawa niya is he just puts this on top. Like that. So maybe we'll try that. Kasi nakita ko yun sa ano niya, isang session niya. Ayan. So, parang iipit mo lang yung... Uh, let me make sure it's zoomed. There we go. He makes sure that the pollen is touching the pistil like that. And then, he just closes it and lets it be. Ayan. So, we did two methods today. We did the Serdan uh, method, which is he parang placed the cap. And then, the other one is the regular method. So... Nice to experiment on these things and hopefully we'll, we'll find out I think after one week. Kapag hindi natuyo yung um, parang stub like this one. Pag hindi siya natuyo and then napansin yung tumataba. This one, like this one. Yan, this one. Yan. Like this one. Ipig sabihin yan, successful ang inyong pollination. Yan. Uh, there we go. Mm. And if it does, after I think a couple of weeks, um, you'll see you have you just have to wait for the pod to I think to burst, no, it will turn red and then it will burst. So mahihinug siya. And then I heard also from one of the um yung mga veteran gymno collectors natin that what they do to find out kung nag take yung um pollen is they sometimes they bump it a little. Pag hindi nalaglag, then it's a success. If it falls off, then it's a dud or failed siya. So, hopefully, um, hopefully, maging okay sila lahat. And, galing, galing. Kasi like this one, I, we were able to pollinate um, this plant with two different parent pollens, no? Parent plants. So, hopefully, we'll uh, see. Next time naman, uh, we'll try to sow naman um, gymno seeds. So, I'm trying to complete my process with Echeverias, with um, cactus, with gy gymnos, and, and then maybe hopefully we can also try to propagate through pups. Papaugatin natin yung mga pups. Hanap tayo ng mag magandang method kung paano magpa magpaugat ng pups from um, from ripe parents. And like this one kasi June na siya. Ang laki-laki na niya. Ayan. Diba? This one is so big already. I think it's about time for her to um, to be taken out and have her own pot. Same, same with this one. Ang laki na niya. Ayan o. Oh. Kasing laki niya na yung ano. Pero mga 2 inches na siya. Ayan. So, bait din to. Si uh, English Red ba yan? So, hopefully we'll get puppy soon. Ah, uh, no. Sorry. Seed soon. Okay, dokey. We'll see you again in a couple of weeks for the update. Bye. I get so caught up in the middle, thinking of drowning in those blue eyes. I'm losing sight because I am falling. I'm so deep.